Hi there, everybody. Mike Petrus here, your star realtor of star and the Treasure Valley back with another episode where we're going to go ahead and travel the Treasure Valley, but we're going to go Northwest and we're going to go more country and visit the city of Payette and talk about that. But before we do, please click on that subscribe button below. Also, if you're thinking about making a relocation here to the greater Treasure Valley area or beyond, feel free to go ahead and click in that description button below, download my free relocation guide so that that way you're in the know before you decide to make the move. So let's go ahead, let's take a look at the city of Payette, Idaho. Let's start off our tour with a brief history of the city. Payette was originally known as Boomerang. The area was initially served by the Oregon Short Line Railroad, and later on the city was renamed after a French-Canadian fur trapper called Francois Payette. It was first settled in 1860, and David S. Lamb was the first settler of the area. The city was officially incorporated in 1891, and Payette became the county seat of the newly formed Payette County in 1917. Today, Payette's County Historical Society will surely help you get a glimpse of the area's history. One can also visit the Four Rivers Cultural Center and Museum, Payette County Museum, National Old Time Fiddlers Hall of Fame, and of course, Fort Boise. Geographically, Payette consists of mainly flat farmland. However, it is within close proximity of the awesome Payette River and is inside of majestic, visible hillsides. Payette is located just a little over an hour northwest from the state capital of Boise. If coming from Boise, the trip to Payette runs through neighboring Fruitland on Highway 84. Although there is alternative highway routes to go, Highway 84 generally proves the fastest for the highway allows traffic to do 80 miles per hour as you pass Highway 44. Today, Payette is a city in and the county seat of Payette County, Idaho. The population was 7,433, with 2,816 households and 1,910 families living within the city at the time of the 2010 census. The current population is estimated to be hovering around 7,700 today, and the city in itself has a quaint, rural, old city charm to its downtown and surrounding neighborhoods. According to the United States Census Bureau, the city has a total area of 3.86 square miles, of which 3.85 square miles is land and 0.01 square miles is water. Weather-wise, Payette experiences a semi-arid climate with cold, moist winters and hot, dry summers. Various mom and pop stores make up the primary shopping of the city. However, the city is slowly growing, allowing some national fast food chains, coffee shops, and a variety of other stores.
Along with access to organically grown foods from local farms, the city also possesses an Albertsons for your grocery shopping needs. The historic downtown area still proves today as the epicenter for nightlife, great restaurant establishments to the area, and shopping. The historic downtown boasts a nail shop, bars with entertainment, a gun store, pizza shops, cafes, clothing stores, and so much more. To truly relive the history of Payette, visit the downtown area. Due to the size of the city, education options are limited within Payette. However, Payette currently has a primary public elementary school, middle school, and high school. Some private schools are also available. Preschools and daycares also have availability within the city limits. Currently, the school system within the city of Payette maintains a C- rating according to niche.com. For more information about the schools in the area before you make the move, please visit www.greatschools.org. Medical-wise, the city of Payette consists mainly of primary care physicians and pediatrics. To gain access to urgent care facilities, one may need to travel to nearby Fruitland to obtain such services. Neighboring across the border inside Ontario, Oregon is a St. Alphonsus Hospital, a short 12-minute drive away from the heart of Payette. St. Al's in Ontario possesses the closest emergency room and a variety of other medical services. Please visit www.stalphonsus.org for a full list of services available in Ontario. Payette Police Department and Payette County Sheriff's Office currently patrols the area. The Payette Police Department and the Sheriff's Office currently maintain 18.8 officers per 10,000 residents. That's more officers per population than 62% of all departments located within the U.S. 3,600 arrests have been reported to have been made between 2013 and 2020, 80% of such being considered low-level offenses. 2,868 to be exact, making up 55 arrests per 1,000 people. Recreation-wise, the city of Payette primarily boasts a great number of parks. It also has a green belt with a pond and even a public pool. These areas are wonderful places to have a family barbecue, play sports, walk about, or just kick back and enjoy the day. This is a view of Centennial Park, located in the north end of Payette, bordering the Snake River. Let's not forget one of the main attractions to the city of Payette, and that's the river systems. Payette borders both the Payette River and the Snake. These rivers are known for whitewater rafting at various locations within the Idaho borders. You can also load your water recreational vehicle into the Snake River from the docks located on the west end of Centennial Park, right within Payette city limits. It's also a great place to fish, and just hang out by, relax, and enjoy the beauty. Last but not least, let's talk about housing in Payette. The housing available primarily consists of older resale homes. However, new construction does exist within its city limits, but not on a grand scale as seen in the Treasure Valley cities like Meridian, Star, Boise, Cuna, or Eagle. Some of the new spec track home builders consist of Titan, Hanu, and ZH Homes. On the outskirts of the city is where you'll find most farms and some ranches. If you are looking to purchase land and build, Payette has some fine custom builders available for hire right within the city limits. Call me at 208-715-7827 today to discuss new, custom, resale homes and land available in the Payette area. 
Hi there and welcome back after the video. I really do hope that you enjoyed that wonderful tour of Payette, Idaho. And of course, if you do have any further questions regarding the town or you're looking to maybe buy, sell or invest within Payette, feel free to reach out to me. You can get a hold of me at area code 208-715-STAR. Again, that's 208-715-7827. Also, don't forget to click in the uh, description below, download my free relocation guide. So that way, if you're thinking about moving to the Treasure Valley in specific, uh, it will give you all the information that you need to know before you decide to make the move. Also, if you're looking to maybe start your home shopping experience, you can visit my website at www.yourstarrealtor.com to begin. Also, please, again, click on that subscribe button, or subscribe button below, so that way you're constantly in tune to all the videos that I come up with. But again, thank you so much. I look forward to the day that I do speak with you. I look forward to the day that I call you my neighbor. God bless, and until the next video, thank you so much. Bye-bye.